This is not going to be a fun video to make, I will say that, and many of you probably didn't even see this video and have no idea what I'm talking about, but this morning when I woke up, I woke up to about 100 missed calls and 100 texts. One of my friends had texted me and he said, hey man, you gotta check TikTok. He sent me a link, I clicked on it, and this person had actually ended up doxing and leaking all of my information, including my phone number, my address, my email, photos of my parents, all this stuff. So right, obviously I was very concerned about this. I was thinking, hey man, people now know exactly where I live. The dude even included photos of where I live. So I do wanna talk about this a little bit and kind of clear the air. We're gonna air this out. Now, if any of you guys have been keeping up with my TikTok and all these meme content videos that I've been doing lately, you'll know that I have this group of people I refer to as the ops, and I have this other group of people that I refer to as the allies. Now, of course, there's no actual ops or allies, I like every single person from this group because it's just a fun little side project. But the thing is, one of the ops, I think, maybe misunderstood uh, how far we're allowed to take this stuff, but they ended up getting this information from a website that I will not be naming because I don't want other people coming to my house and posting it online. Fortunately, the video only got like five or 600 views. He stated in the comments that if I commented on it and told him to take it down, he would. As soon as I did that, he immediately removed it. So no harm, no foul in that sense, but I'm assuming he didn't understand the severity of doing something like that, doxing somebody. Now, immediately upon seeing that video, there are two concerns that come to my mind personally, and maybe there are more that I haven't thought about yet. But number one, obviously I don't want uh, supporters or part of parts of my community coming to my house because that's just a little bit odd. But number two is obviously I feel like there's this stigma about social media creators, especially ones that are somewhat larger in the millions of followers that they have a ton of money. And I don't want the wrong type of person to see that video and then think, Oh, I know exactly where he lives. He's a content creator, so he probably has nice stuff in his apartment, which, spoiler alert, I don't. I don't spend money on anything. And I'm going to show up to his house and rob it. Those are the things that I'm most concerned about when I see a video like that where I'm getting docs. So with that being said, I'm not trying to ramble on about this and squeeze this video to 10 minutes. I just wanna make this point very clear. If you guys are able to find my address or my phone number or my email and stuff like that, please do not post that online. That is information that I haven't put out there publicly for a reason. And also, please don't show up to my house. I'm sure that I would love to meet many of the people that are supporters and the community and stuff like that, but it should be organic. It shouldn't be people showing up to my place. You know, I don't wanna come across as, excuse my language, an asshole but I definitely don't want people showing up in my house. It's also quite dangerous to show up unexpected at other people's houses as well. I, um, you know, I live in the United States of America. I'm a God-fearing, red-blooded American, and I do have a couple pieces of equipment in my house, you know, that shoot lead from them. And I've always automatically kind of been a person on edge. Whenever somebody knocks at my door late at night or something like that, I take a peek through the peephole. I'm just that type of person and I don't want a bunch of people showing up to my house and for an accident to happen like that. Now trust me, I'm not just gonna go out guns a blazing type of thing, but you know, just saying, I can't distinguish the, the difference between somebody that's a supporter or somebody that's showing up because they wanna rob me if they know my address. It's just too risky to not show up with that in, you know, like in my waistband or something like that. So with that being said, I just wanna wrap it up in a nice little bow here. If you guys have seen that video, please do not come to my house. Uh, I would be less upset if you texted me or whatever. I honestly don't really care too much about that. Obviously, I don't want my number everywhere, but if you want to text me and say that you enjoy my videos or whatever like that, I'm not going to be upset about that. Uh, email, same thing. But yeah, don't show up to my house unannounced. Please, 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 please. Uh, if you find my address, please don't post it anywhere. And I guess that's about it. This is really the, the whole entire video here. Just a little PSA if you will. Appreciate you guys. Love you.